All right, so the next part is, now we're gonna go from north to south. My uncle Oscar would often say, if you can't attack the north, attack by way of the south, circumvent. So that way you're not known as far as what your motives are. A lot of times Wing Chun people, Taekwondo people, Karate people, all that, they're a bunch of headhunters. And that's all they can do. You don't understand that sometimes hidden to a body will allow you to get the head. If, if he was to push me in my stomach right now, go ahead, see what I'm saying? My head is there. So if you can't get the north, and I'm a big tall guy compared to him, if you can't get the north, attack the south. So then you can come back and attack the north or more. I'll give you one more example and I want him to do it because he's really good at it. Um, and then that, this is kind of a break out of the Gonsai character, but I just want you to see this real quick. He's gonna take out my leg, whether he sweeps it or side kicks it or whatever, but his goal is he's gonna have me down. That way he can do a kick that is sizable towards my head. This is the idea of attacking south to attack the north. So let's say I'm like this, for example, he's attacking the knee, go ahead. I'm down, now he has a clear shot for my head, whether it be the hands or whether he does a kick towards my head. Try to kick towards my head, you see? So there it is. So that's my idea from Uncle Oscar. Uncle Oscar is my first Kung Fu teacher. And I think it's easy, it's called the compass method. To be honest, north, south, south, north, east, west, understand the directions and what you can do with it. So now let's get back to Gone South. So right here, if I'm right here in this case, I'm slipping to grab a control. Now he can try to pull his arm down, go ahead. But as long as I hold a good enough grip, it gives me enough time. I'm not doing the thumb lop south. This is a chin mistake waiting to happen, right? I'm doing the lob style for fingers. So as, I, as I'm right here and I slip the hand, even if he fights it, it's too late. I have a strike here, right? And then I can always fall it up, up the top, but I'm striking low at first. So he's gonna do that towards me. Been doing it a couple of times. He's going low. He's attacking me low so that he can come back up north and conquer.